All right, thank you all for being here. Uh, today we're demoing our cool new sugar messaging app. So um, what we've done is we've partnered with YTEL, one of the leading providers of SMS messaging and other voice and phone system functionality. And in uh, partnering with them, we've created a new messaging functionality within Sugar. So uh, I'm gonna roll through uh, the PowerPoint pretty quick to get to the demo. So about us, you guys know uh, about us, I would think. We've been around a long time. We're a Sugar Elite partner. We were the Sugar Global Partner of the Year in 2018. Very excited about that. One of the things that's different about us is that Sugar is the only CRM we support. So it, we found it's hard enough to be great at one thing, much less a bunch of things. So we've decided we're gonna be great at just Sugar in the CRM world. Um, in addition to Sugar, we also partner with Sage, Acton, QuickBase, Monday, and Jira in some other uh, product categories. So we're very big in ERP software and in the project management space. Our team is all in-house. We don't outsource anything. Our corporate headquarters are in Southern California, but we've got offices around the country. And we've done thousands of successful implementations across CRM, ERP, and other uh, applications. Uh, we're known for our integrations in the sugar space. Uh, as you can see, there's a bunch of logos over here on the side. We've won a lot of awards that we're really proud of, and uh, so we're featuring them here. Some of our products and integrations that uh, we've had for many, many years uh, are some of the things that differentiate us from other folks that do what we do. We've integrated sugar with a number of ERP software, whether it's Sage or Intact or QuickBooks and others. Uh, we've also integrated Sugar with other types of things, marketing automation, project management software, uh, document storage, all that kind of thing. We also have a Sugar Mobile e-product that takes the Sugar Mobile product and extends it with a bunch of really cool features as well. So what is Sugar Messaging? This is a new module we've created inside of Sugar called Sugar Messaging. We've integrated Sugar with Whitehealth. So Whitel is handling the back end of the integration of, of the functionality while uh, well, we're taking care of the front end. Some of the key features in this are uh, the ability to text on the fly from any record in Sugar with a mobile phone number. Usually that's a contact or a lead. You can also send texts to uh, one or more uh, recipients using pre-built texting templates. So um, that's kind of cool. You can send text to multiple people at a time from list views by selecting records and clicking a text button. You can integrate text with workflows. So somebody could fill out a form on a website. The uh, form will automatically create a record in Sugar. And based on that, um, <laughs> based on that cool thing, then a text can go out. So that's pretty cool. Uh, you can also send texts via Sugar campaigns, uh, and then everything that gets texted, and these are outbound and inbound texts, all get stored in a messages subpanel under the contacts and leads. Uh, and you can receive return text as well, which is really uh, exciting. So with that, uh, we're gonna get into the demo. That's okay. Uh, if you guys have questions, interrupt me at any time, but I'm uh, excited about doing this. So. Here we go. So this is our Sugar home screen. Uh, I'm not gonna spend a lot of time here, but one of the things to look at is there's uh, a dashlet here that shows you incoming inbound SMS messages. So you can also show outbound messages on this dashlet too, but this is especially valuable for if you have messages going out from one phone number uh, to a bunch of people and it's like a customer service phone number that it's going out to, they can all come back in messages received into this dashlet, you can have somebody responsible for managing the inbound texts. So these are kind of cool. You get to see it's an inbound message. You get to see what the message is. You get to see who sent the message because you could have multiple senders. And then some other things about this as well. And you could drill down on this also. Let me, to start, I just want to show you some uh, admin housekeeping things. So if we go to the admin screen,
You'll see down here at the bottom, there's a sugar messaging function that's been added. <clears throat> and there's just a couple simple things here. One is sugar messaging configuration. And it's really, you know, is it, is it enabled? Yes. And there's a couple things uh, that we need to enter when we configure messaging in your sugar environment. And these are things that allow sugar to communicate with YTEL. The second thing is a phone numbers link. And this is where you send out your outbound texting from phone numbers. And you get these from YTEL and you can get as many as you want. We just have one for purposes of the demo, but you know it's a matter of buying the phone numbers from YTEL and they have all kinds of great deals for that stuff. So these are this is a list of the text from phone numbers. Uh, the other thing to show you just from a setup standpoint is, it's important, is there's a message templates feature. So this is where you can set up texting templates that can automatically be selected to go out to people. So for example, we have one here called Sale on Friday. And it's called Sale on Friday, and this is a message, and you'll see it says dollar sign, contact, underscore, first name. We're having a sale on Friday. And we'll be using this template in the demo in a little bit, but you can see you can pick fields uh, from the Sugar database and incorporate them into the message so that it personalizes the messages. So this is the message template, okay? So just wanted you guys to see that. Hang on, I'm gonna make a note about something here in a second, so bear with me. Okay, great. So uh, I'm gonna start by going into our contacts screen, okay? So if I go to the contacts screen, I have a list of contacts. And what I can do is, let's, uh, let's do something here, hang on. Just give me, bear with me for a second. I'm gonna pick one of your names for this. So, hang on. Okay, great. So I'm going to add a new uh, contact in here to demonstrate this real quickly, right? So I'm going to say, this is Aaron, this is Mr. Aaron Wine, and he's at Fay Business Systems Group, and that's okay. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put your mobile number in here, and Aaron's mobile number is 512-947-9111. Now notice there's also a do not SMS checkbox here. So if we check that, this user would never get any texts from us. Okay, so I just added a new contact called Aaron. Now if I click on Aaron, you'll notice next to the mobile phone number, there's a little cloudy sort of thing. If I click on the cloud, a messaging window pops up. Now let's say I want to do something just sort of custom to Aaron. I could go, hey, how about those cowboys, dude? And that's, that's, a, that's a good one, right? How about those cowboys, dude? That might sound really business-like, but let's say I wanted to send that to Aaron. So I'm just gonna click send, and hopefully Aaron will get a text momentarily. Aaron, you can jump in if you get that. No, well, maybe Aaron's not on. Let's see. I thought I heard his voice. So we sent an outbound message to Aaron. Now the other thing we could do with Aaron is we can go to the text button and say, you know what? I want to just send him a text from a template that we have. And so we have a template called Sale on Friday. And I'm going to send that one. And you'll notice down here under the sub panel, both those messages went out to Aaron. It's kind of cool. Now, the other things we can do here are uh, from this screen is I can do a group text. So let's say um, I've got my contact list view and I want to send a text to me, Jeff, and Aaron. Wait, hold on here. I'm gonna I'm gonna do something. Yeah, me, Jeff, and Aaron. 
So I'm going to do that. So I've checked all those. And here I'm going to say click send message. I have to pick a template. Let's just pick the sale on Friday. Let's pick the mass. There's another one here called a mass SMS message text. I can click send. Okay. Oh, and I just got a text on my phone right now. I don't know if you heard the beep. It says, David, this is a test from the SMS mass messaging. And if I went in and pulled up my contact record, you can see the message right here. Outbound message sent to David Fay. This is a test from the SMS mass messaging. So easy enough to pick records from a list view. And by the way, this would work from a leads list view as well. Okay. Um, now I'm going to text back. I just received that text. So I'm going to say, um, thanks for the text. And I sent it back. And that'll, that'll show up in here in, uh, in a moment or two. So while we're waiting for that to happen, uh, I want to show you something else that's really cool about this, using workflows and uh, web to lead forms. So, so we, we, we created this basic web to lead form here, and this is just using the sugar web to lead form functionality, so it's definitely not pretty, but this is an example of how cool this would be. So let's say uh, some guy I know named David Hyman decided to fill out a form on here. And he wrote, please contact me ASAP. And I'm going to click Submit. Okay. So, so I just filled out a, a web to lead form. Now what happens is, I click my leads. There's David Hyman. So it automatically populated David Hyman in the leads module. And over here, we have a workflow set up. And this workflow says there's a lead with a mobile phone number with a certain campaign, and we know it's this campaign because it was on that particular web to lead form. It's going to wait a minute and then send David Hyman a text. Then it's going to wait 10 minutes and it's going to send a follow up text. So, um, so I think if we look in here, David Hyman in this lead. Okay, so the message hasn't been sent yet. We got to give it a minute. I'm going to move that up there. And um, let's check out David Fay and see if my text back got back yet. Oh, so there's my, I texted back from the message I received and here it is. Inbound message received from David Fay. Thanks for the text. So I texted back into the system and it's got a record of this here. So this is some pretty cool communication recording. You can see all the texting history. In addition, if you got it. All right, David, that's you receiving cool. the text. Yep. David, welcome to SMS messaging. Yeah. So that's so it's pretty exciting if, if you can think up uh, if you can think of the the potential for this is Somebody, one of your customers or prospects can fill out a form on a website and within a minute, Sugar can automatically send a text back to them. And that's pretty cool. That's pretty, that's seamless communication that doesn't require a sales rep to do anything. But when the sales rep goes and pulls up a record, he can see that David got this text. And if David sends a text back, we'll see it here. The other thing is in, in 10 minutes, and, I'm, and we'll probably be done within 10 minutes, so we won't get to experience this together, but in 10 minutes, David's gonna get another text. Again, based on um, this, there's gonna be some follow-up questions sent to him, or, or it's gonna ask him if he has any questions. So again, the, the power of this is in a number of ways. It's Number one, you can do impromptu texting from your desktop, uh, which is you know a newer way of communicating with prospects and customers. Two, you can do group texts. You know, if you're having a sale on an item, you can you can go select a bunch of uh, contacts or leads, 
You can integrate this with campaigns. So, for example, if you have a campaign on this, so this is our SMS messaging campaign. We've got a couple targets. You know, I can go here and I can click send messages and it'll send a message to everybody in the target list in this campaign. So that's pretty powerful as well. Um, lots of uh, creative things you can do with this, but again, I think I'm, I'm mostly uh, excited about this workflow thing and the web to lead form. You can totally customize it. You can create a web to lead form. You know, we, we all have things we're doing in our lives where this comes into play. Um, you know, I have a maintenance plan, a home warranty plan at my house. And I, right now, when I have a problem with one of my appliances, I'll go online and I'll fill out a form on their website. And immediately upon clicking submit, I will get a text from them saying, hey, your, uh, your maintenance company has been informed and you should get contacted within 24 hours. And then they will continue to follow up with me via text. And the uh, technology that's doing that for me with my home warranty company is the same technology now that all sugar users can have with this uh, new integration that we've come out with. So really excited about this. Um, uh, and uh, certainly love to um, talk with anybody more about it who's interested. The requirements are really you have to have an active YTEL account. Um, and there's a cost to that. And the cost for YTEL is primarily based on usage. And there's a certain uh, cost per text that's, you know, less, less than a penny per text, that kind of thing. And we can get pricing for anybody that needs it. Um, and then obviously our sugar messaging module. 